soma. Soma. Really good. Really long. I fell asleep twice. Actually, us being from Texas, we should be able to defend or speak up for our boy, LBJ, who was misportrayed big time in the movie. Kind of. Not kind of. No. He actually signed the stuff before Selma. Like, it, there wasn't a, oh, pressure on the president. Like, it's misinformation. And people only remember misinformation that they view in movies. movies or media. That's it. I mean, he may have used the N-word as freely as everybody else mm -hmm. that was, you know, a white person of that time. He may not have had any love for, like, having me over for dinner. Right. I don't know all of his business. All we can do is look at the historical record, which said LBJ was down for civil rights and letting black people have the vote. All right. And, uh, More topics. That Jackie Robinson Little League baseball team that won the World Series yeah. got their title revolt. It was the first like all black Little League World baseball team that went that won it, and then they took away the title in Black History Month. That was messed up, huh? <laughs> You're like, two more weeks, guys. We, we could have made it, man. <laughs> you know what? The, the thing that upsets me about that is it's not the kids' fault, no, right? No, it's the parents' fault. Like it's, you got to blame the parents' yeah. fault. Yeah. People do that all the time. I did it. <laughs> my mom lied about my age to get me into kindergarten sooner. There's so many rules that are broken in, in America, Daily. in the world. I mean, if you follow me in a day, maybe I am breaking a rule. I don't know. There's some laws I think are stupid. Jaywalking. Definitely. NPR did this amazing piece about how it costs you to be poor and that you can get jail time for unpaid tickets. Like the American judicial system, like, do you think it's fair? Do you think certain crimes should like deserve longer punishment as we decriminalize like marijuana right like all the people that are still in prison over like marijuana stuff i'm sure they're like are you kidding me i've i've been doing 10 years here well i got arrested for pot for seven grams of marijuana just show me what is seven grams it, it honestly can fit in like the palm of my hand okay where was this in pensacola florida oh florida the penis of america and, like getting my like first and like point of view of being what it's like being in jail how like people can get trapped in that system it's like i had to pay off like a lawyer five thousand wow. dollars like i had to fly back like 700 dollar plane tickets to go like to 15 minute hearings it's amazing you had enough money for all that most people end up with jail time if you can yeah. afford that like it were, was it that bad like was it that bad of a crime i was only in for 33 hours and you start asking around, but like, oh, you know, I've been in here all the time. I just, you know, got picked up on crack again. Yeah, I'll be out tomorrow. Like, new people came in in the morning. Oh, what's up, Chris? What you do this time, man? Oh, you know, man. Da, da, da. It's like a, it's a systematic, like, brainwash. It's like, this is so normal. You know, oh, man, I've been in here so many times, man. This ain't nothing new to me. All right, so yeah, you got you got some personal beef about I do. pot policy. I, do. I got I got it. Are you stoned right now? No, I'm not actually. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching News Hangover. Um, if if you like it, you should subscribe down here, or check out these old, older videos. This one was pretty funny too. Um, this one was really funny actually. Um, Kelly's funny, so why why not watch it? Lang Bang approves. I approve. I approve this message.